Welcome back to Skyway TJ, guys, and today we're coming back to another episode of Today I Watch. This is my series where I watch a movie every single weekday for 2021 and give my first impressions, thoughts, and a little bit of a, a little bit of a review here for you. Uh, if you like what you're about to see, please drop that like and subscribe for more. I make videos every single week, and without further ado, we're gonna roll the intro. No cut. So today I watched Fifty First Dates for the first time. I'm sure you've heard of it. It has Adam Sandler in there, uh, Drew Barrymore, Rob Schneider, all that fun. Uh, this is a romantic comedy where the basic rundown is that Adam Sandler is a bit of a womanizer who has trust and co uh, relationship commitment issues. And Drew Barrymore is a girl who at every night her memory resets because she has amnesia from an accident which causes her short-term memory to go away, so she never remembers meeting Adam Sandler's character. And through all these events, he keeps trying to woo her each and every day because he's falling in love with her. And yeah, there's your romantic comedy scenario. This is easily one of Adam Sandler's best things that I've ever seen. I watch a lot of his movies, and this one I really, really, really enjoyed. It might be because I'm a, I'm a sucker for romantic comedies, but I just like the premise of this one. And I thought it was very sweet that his character would constantly find new ways to remind her that they've been, that he loves her and that they've been together this whole time. And the way he made that tape so she, she could watch it every day and they could, she could realize that they had met and been dating. And it's just, it's just very cute and very adorable. And I love it so much. And I just want to give particular particular praise to Adam Sandler, Andrew Barrymore. I think they portray some of the best couples in like movies. Like I've saw them before in the wedding singer and that's one of my favorite Adam Sandler movies. So I just think they do a really good job. They bounce really well off one of another. I'm sure they have a very personal friendship off camera. It's just, it just works very well. And it's always nice to see Adam Sandler like evolve a bit like i know this movie is old but like you you associate him with being the you know adam sandler noises being a schlub that always gets the girl but in this one he was actually very sweet and it brought another side to sandler that i don't see that often and i really enjoyed it and i think this is one of his best movies for sure well guys that's been my first little thoughts and impressions about 50 first dates hope you guys enjoyed that if you did please drop that like and subscribe for more I make videos every single week. Uh, I will be back tomorrow with another Today I Watched. Still don't know what I'm watching yet. Love just getting up in the morning, turning on the TV and picking something. So there will be another one of these tomorrow. Uh, yeah, I'm thinking about doing a, like, ranking every Adam Sandler movie. But I have to watch all of them. There are some I'm missing. So if you want to see that, please let me know. I would love to do that because I think Adam Sandler is one of my favorite actors. Because, like, no matter what... His movies can either hit or miss, but I'll still love him no matter what. So, yeah, if you want to see that, guys, let me know. Uh, but, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow with another video. I will see you then. Stay safe out there during Corona times. And, uh, yeah, again, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!